Hey guys. Well, I got me a new toy. I, uh, it's a Hobie Cat 16. It's made back in 1985. It's actually in pretty good shape. Uh, there's some things I still got to do. I got a problem with the, uh, the can or the, uh, spring and, uh, the, the rudders won't come up uh, because they're, well, without, you, you can lift the tiller uh, arms and get the rudders up, but uh, they don't, they don't spring up on their own. I've been cleaning it up. It's, uh, it's actually in pretty good shape. The holes don't have any problems. And uh, this was actually a Coleman model and uh they had they there was a period of time there they made uh what they call a red line hull where it has just a faint line of red i don't know if you can see that or not but um it's got a little red line that goes down the center of the the fiberglass and it's the way they put it together these models haven't had too much trouble with their uh, delamination uh, makes for a stronger lighter hole and uh, just got me a new tramp put this on the other day and uh, I, I got it set up and uh, I put the the sails on here, and uh, it's got a a float to keep your uh, your mass from turtling in the water. And I'm just getting everything set up. Make sure I've got all the parts. I got the a pretty good sized block on the back here. It's a uh, it's a pretty good size block on that. And uh, the only thing it didn't come with, it's only got two trapeze wires, which I don't have those installed right now. Um, so I got, I've only got two trapeze wires and, and I'm waiting on my uh, boat numbers. Uh, well, actually I've got uh, I've got the numbers on order. I just went ahead and ordered them online. The trailer's made of aluminum, but we do have some steel, which is pretty rusted. This uh, this old winch here, and then the the front uh, ball adapter, uh, it's rusted out pretty bad. Um. Uh, but now the holes are in really good shape. I waxed the hole or uh, used some uh, deoxidizing McGuire's and then did, did some uh, cleaner uh, wax and then uh, did some aluminum uh, cleaner on all the railings and the rail rugs aren't that bad of shape. Uh, shows a little bit of wear, but it's really not that bad. Came with a whole bunch of little, little parts and accessories. It's crazy how much all this little stuff costs. It's got a little, uh, it's got a little Harkin block uh, that is for the jib or well actually that might be the downhaul block it's got a small downhaul haul block on there but uh, I guess that's what they were using for now but this one would probably be a little bit stronger because it's got more leverage these are my trapeze wires which I don't have installed yet and it's got the old uh, style 
and so everything seems to be in good shape I've got uh, got the blocks here with the uh, might want to take uh, I noticed like uh, this is almost like lichen uh, uh, fungus and so um, what I was thinking I might do is take these ropes and put them put them in one of these bags and laundry the ropes in the washer this is actually a pretty good size rope here this is uh, the main and uh, so anyway got a lot of scratches in the boom and the and the mass but other than that it's the boats in pretty good shape got a few little problems like I say uh, the rudders the rudders do have well it's kind of hard to show you but rudders do have some play in them so I've got some stiffeners uh, and uh, I've got some bushings and uh, I'm gonna try to get that straightened out but anyway yeah this is my latest project and uh, the tiller arm looks like brand new they must have kept this thing in the inside because uh, it's in really good shape but um, I don't think this boat was used that off that much and uh, it's really really a pretty nice here let me back up and I'll give you a, a better view of it and uh, I need to I need to take the wheels off the trailer and check the bearings I'd hate to be going down the road and and lose this thing over that so they did give me an extra tire with it you see it laying there in the grass but uh anyway I just thought I would uh, share this with you and these uh, let's see what is this blue Hawaii sails I believe it is so anyway, I'll talk to you later.